Welcome to Love Linnell and Beauty. Please subscribe to my channel. Click on the notification bell. And also, don't forget to click on the like button if you like the video. Thank you. Hi guys, welcome to Lovely Nail and Beauty Clay. Today I have a new project. I'm going to teach you how to create jewelry with clay. So I'm going to show you what I use for my project before we start. So right there I have some sheet plastic that I'm going to use. And in this box I have some uh, stool for ear hook. And I have my clay over there. So I choose those colors for my project. They are very bright and also I have this necklace that I'm going to use. So I'm going to try to create, uh, let me show you this one. And right there I have different tool. I have hair, hook, needle, you know, so that's and beans. And also I have right there a ring holder. I would like to create a ring too. So I'm gonna put it on the side and right there I have the rolling pin that's what I'm gonna use and I have my blade over there to cut my clay there is two different blades the long one and the short one so I'm gonna put it on the side so now I'm gonna start my project and I don't have any fake nail when I'm doing the clay project so I'm gonna take my sheet plastic over there and i'm gonna open my clay i'm gonna start with the blue and use my blade for that so i like the color that i choose they are bright color and i hope that you guys you're gonna love the project so the project today is how to create jewelry jewelry with clay that's the project of today so i'm gonna cut a small piece a half of it that's okay for my clay so the project is new i never done a video like that before so i hope that you guys you're gonna like it so i'm gonna make it a ball and i'm gonna use my rolling pin to make it flat i would like to create a flat sheet of clay so that's the blue i like that blue it's very nice so the project today is new and i'm gonna choose the process is gonna same because I'm gonna use different color of clay and the first step is to make them flat like that that's what I'm gonna do first and you know put them one after the other one so I would like to thanks my viewer and my subscriber even those who watch my video and does not subscribe to my channel thank you so much for your time I really do appreciate and it means a lot to me so now I'm going to now take the other sheet plastic and I'm going to take this green. I really love the color that I choose. So the process is going to be the same for now. That's the first step of the project. And for those who would like to subscribe to my channel, you can go, you can type Love Linnell and Beauty on YouTube. My channel is based on beauty, art, decoration, creation, nail so there is different project inside you can go and see if there is something that you like even if there is something that you don't like i will be glad to hear from you because of your comment i learned a lot about the quality of my video how i present my project so i will be glad to hear from you so the clay art is something new for me so this is gonna be my second video where i'm working with clay and you know i hope that you're gonna love it but i like it so far it's so fun to work with so this is my second clay color that i'm gonna use i'm gonna put it on the top of the blue one there we go i'm gonna put it on the side and i'm gonna use the third color so it's something new and I like the color that I choose. Yes, I was saying that my channel is based on beauty, art, decoration. There is so many different projects. You can go watch and see if there is something that you like. And I, I don't do everything in my channel, but I try to learn much as I can and present whatever I can present to you guys. So 
if you want you can go on lovely nail and beauty and have a look on my channel and this channel is i have it for a couple of months now so it's kind of new compared to other channels okay that's the pink one i like the color it's so bright this one i make the clay a little bit more thin that's why i take my time to take it off from the sheet the plastic sheet okay that's good now i'm gonna add that on the top of this one and now i'm gonna create the last color of clay so it's gonna be is a yellow that look like orange so i i skipped some step already because the process is the same i'm just gonna create my yellow sheet is a yellow that look like it's between yellow and orange i can say i don't know the right name for that color so but i like the color it looks so nice so now this is gonna be the last sheet that i'm gonna put on the top of the other one that i have on the side and from there we're gonna start to create a jewelry okay so now i'm picking up all of them once and now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut this side, it's too much pink, and I'm gonna hold my sheet. I'm gonna hold them like that. Okay. Okay, that's perfect. So now it's roll because I would like my jewelry to be colorful. I like color. So then I'm gonna hold again my clay, just a little bit. Okay, that's enough that's perfect and now i'm gonna use my blade i'm gonna use the short one so i'm gonna try to cut uh four pieces of clay because i'm gonna start to realize look at that it looks so nice the color i'm just gonna cut four or five pieces because um, i need to create the necklace the earring the ring so let's see so this one i'm gonna use my roller pin this one i'm gonna create first the necklace because it's gonna be much bigger i like the way it looks it's amazing okay you, you can see all the color in once and i love it it looks nice it's very nice so this is for the necklace and now i'm gonna put a golden stone in the middle I want that to be a little bit sparkle there we go that looks so nice i love it the color are very bright that's that's for the necklace and uh, i'm gonna use i have the earring the earring hook and i have the needle it's a special needle and here i have my pink beans so i put the pin, the beans inside of the needle and i'm gonna put that inside of the the earring there we go it's gonna help me to connect with the earring hook okay that's good all right so now i'm gonna put it on the side first okay that looks so beautiful and i'm gonna do the same thing i'm gonna put it on the side and i'm gonna try to create now the earring so I will just show you for one earring because the process is the same. There is no big difference. So I have my color here and I'm going to use my roller pin. Again, I'm going to flat that, but it should not be too flat though. So that looks so nice. I love it. It looks beautiful. I really love it. So now I'm going to take it off. But I try to create the shape that I want first. And I'm going to add some golden stone that I have. They are very small, but they sparkle. I love them. I'm going to put it inside. Okay. Now one is enough. I don't need to add another one. Okay, so I'm going to take it off. That looks so cute. I love it. That looks so nice. Okay. That's perfect. Now I'm going to pick up again my needle. Oh, before I put the needle, I should have put first the beans. So I put the beans inside. They are wood beans, colored wood beans. And I'm going to put my needle. It's going to help me to, to put the hooker 
from the necklace or earring so right there i have a two as you see the the necklace and the earring they look pure, pretty i put it on the side and again right there i'm gonna cut again and this one i'm gonna try to create my earring i don't need too much because the earring is small i'm gonna try to create the shape that i want for my ring Alvin, yeah i'm creating the ring now not the earring sorry so i don't need a lot of clay for that so i try to create kind of a ball a flat ball that's what i try to do but i like the color that i choose it's so colorful and now i have my ring hoop holder sorry my ring holder and i'm gonna try to adjust my clay to my ring holder but i like the color it's really look nice it's bright color so now i make sure that i gain the shape that i want for my ring it's very nice to do the clay project you have to play with your hands a lot especially your finger to create shape that you want and it's something new and now i'm gonna add a small gold stone they are very sparkled in the middle okay all right that's nice so now i'm gonna use that and i'm gonna stick the clay to the ring holder okay that looks so nice i love it and i'm gonna work again on the shape of the clay that's so cute it's so simple to do and each time that i'm doing a clay project i don't wear artificial nail because it does not look clean and pretty to work with the clay so that's my ring it looks so nice i love the way it looks so now when I finish to do my jewelry, you have a two option to make your clay hard. You can put your clay in the hot water or you can heat that with a dry, uh, hair dryer. You have the choice. So I have mine over there. It's a small one. I'm going to heat my clay for like 30 minutes straight. And after that, we're going to come back to finish our project. So after I finish to heat my clay, you can see it's hard already. I love the color. So I'm going to start with the necklace. I have my necklace here. And uh, I have this, uh, this uh, ring, small ring. And I have my tweezer on the side. It's going to help me to open the small ring. So it's going to help me to connect the necklace to the jewelry that I want so I open the ring the small ring and I put it inside of my necklace I'm, and I'm gonna connect the necklace to the object so it's very simple and nice to do and again for the earring I did one already so I'm just gonna show you the step for one because the step is the same does not change so this is my necklace i love it it looks so nice so i'm gonna close my necklace it's very bright and colorful i really love it and again to do those kind of project if you have an artificial nail it's gonna be hard to do okay i'm gonna put it on the side so now i'm gonna show you for one earring this is the other one that i did already but I just want to show you the step. The step is pretty the same and that's the ring look pretty. So I have here the ring, the small ring, and I have the earring hooker. Use again my tweezer to open the small ring over there. Is it allow me to connect the, 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 the earring hooker to the object. So now I open. Okay, that's okay. And it's kind of pretty hard because everything is so small you need to be precise but so far so good i love what i'm seeing so now i'm gonna try to close my small ring that connect the hooker and the earring so let's see i need to close that everything is very small here so let me try again 
so you have two options when you want to make your clay become hard you can use a hot water and let it cool off or you can use blow dryer so i always use the blow dryer okay it's done that's the earring there we go that's the way it look it's amazing i love them wow it's so colorful and i'm gonna bring everything you're gonna see i love them so thank you so much to my viewer and subscriber i hope that you like the video that you learned something new my jewelry it's so nice that's the ring i love them it's original it's new oh my god thank you so much guys for watching my video and i hope to see you soon be safe bye don't forget to subscribe to my channel to click on the notification bell and on the like button thank you for watching